Hello, and welcome to the news today by Curious Times. In curated for the curious. Sipson Island in the U.S. opened to the public for the first time in 300 years. This island belonged to the Monomoyak tribe. 300 years back, it was taken over by an organization. They preserve the environment and natives of the island. Visitors can now visit the island and have picnics, but have to follow rules. Environmentalists try to stop oil spill in Mauritius. A ship had an accident around a coral reef and is spilling oil. Thousands of underwater species are facing great danger. Mauritius has appealed for international help too. Mauritius is known for its coral reefs and is an ecological hotspot. International support comes in for Beirut port explosion. Beirut had a big explosion last week. 100 people died. It was due to mishandling of a chemical, ammonium nitrate. Over 5,000 people have been injured and many left homeless. UK, France, Germany, Iran have come forward to give support. COVID-19 cases, India 2.2 million, worldwide 19.9 million. Former President Pranab Mukherjee has tested positive for COVID-19. 15% of Delhi students have not attended any online classes. The U.S. has crossed 5 million cases. A new study says rice cookers can sanitize N95 masks. Many states in India face heavy rains and floods. Heavy rains in Kerala has led to landslides and floods. An Air India plane crashed in Kerala, injuring over 100 people. Heavy rain alerts have been issued for Uttar Pradesh and Karnataka too. The news today by Curious Times. In sensationalism free, no editorial bias, age appropriate, curriculum aligned. Every day at 7 p.m. See you tomorrow.